You know, they say uh, around this time of night, um, people become more spiritual. Really? Yeah. Do you, do you, do you think so? What's your, what's your view on that? As in, more, more, more likely to believe, to, 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 or not, not to believe in God, but to sort of care about it or have an opinion about it. Uh, sorry, say again. You don't, you don't. No, 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 no. So, so do, does peop, does the fact that people mean people become more spiritual mean that they have more more to say about? Yeah, like more they... more God conscious. Like probably like maybe um, in a sense like you know they repent, they reflect, they yeah. they think about what's the purpose of life, why am I here, you know things like that. Yeah. And they tend to do it like third part of the night which is kind of like yeah no no it makes a lot of sense yeah I don't think I don't think um, I don't really believe in believe that there's like a, a higher power or whatever but oh you don't believe in a creator no I kind of believe that there's a there's it, it's I, I guess I've not really got much consistent beliefs but I, I believe there's a reason for everything that happens but I don't really believe that there's anybody that sort of controls. I, I guess if if there is anyone that controls it, I don't really think that it, there'd be that, that that worried about whether we go to church every day or every Sunday or whatever. It's more about the way you live your life and that sort of thing. So okay, oh, that's I've interesting. Kind, so kind, I've kind of just had the, had the belief and and my um my. Mum has always, uh, and, my, and that side of my family has always had that had a belief that you should go to you should go to church and that sort of thing. Whereas I more of a belief where if you if you if you live your life the right way, then okay. Yeah, that, uh, uh, was this something that was in like uh, would you say it was something that was kind of enforced on you when you were young to go to church? Not not really enforced on me. I guess it's like it was it was encouraged and encouraged. So I don't think I've really seen um, I've always thought of it as a as something that is a, a good obviously it's a it's a, it's, it's sort of a, a good thing to do but not something that there's a positive side to it. Yeah no, I have always seen the positive side to it but I never really thought that it was something that you you had to do. Sure. Okay. And, it, and, and wh whether you're going to church or going to whatever religion it is, it's. I think that yeah, there's a positive side to getting sort of community together and yeah, and everybody having like a really positive experience together. Yeah. Yeah. What, so, what's your views on uh, on creation? Like, how did how how did we come about? You got a thought I think, on that? Yeah, I think I guess I kind of I've not really thought about it too much, but I guess I have a more of a scientific kind of view of it, and it was that it, yeah, it it just sort of happened, and we're just very lucky that we we're, we're here. <laughs> so there, there, there was just a lot. There, there was a lot of there were a lot of rocks, and are you are you all of a sudden people are, people sort of turn up, and and there was. Oh, oh, so yeah, I guess it's the, the the evolution side of it. Okay, the evolution. Right. Okay. Um, are you are you familiar with the theory of? Uh, are you quite familiar with the theory of evolution? Like uh, as to wh when like um, this theory came about? How long ago it's been? In, in a, where it's been circling around? I, I guess I know I know a little bit about it, but not masses about it. <laughs> how, how what would you see the first? Uh, um, you know, reported date when when such a theory came about. I I think it was the seventeen fifty years I guess the, something in the seventeen hundreds. Um, when when someone thought that yeah yeah when that we we might have happened by more than just um God creating us, but um yeah. I so you say that. Two, 250, 300 years? Yeah, it's, it's about, yeah. Okay. I uh, guess, yeah, about, yeah, about. 
250 years ago, is that right? Yeah. And 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 what about? I mean, uh, are you aware that the universe is expanding as well? Yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm aware of that. Do you know? Do you, do you know when we we kind of like discovered that? That that I think I think that's quite recent. Yeah. And I yeah. think uh, last maybe I don't even want to predict because uh, it it would just be a guess, but it, I I I think you're right. That it's quite recent. And yeah, yeah, it's quite um, yeah, it's quite scary how 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 big a place it is and how how little we probably know about it. But um, but here's the thing, right? If uh, if it's expanding, yeah, if the universe is yeah. expanding, then you know when we rewind and we go back, like I say, like okay, we're here, but how did we begin, right? Um, we come back to a single point, the singularity point, right? Yeah. Um, and you know, who, who do you think? Uh, I mean, how do you think that came about? Have you, have you got a thought on that? And then how how did we how did we come into existence? Yeah. I mean, like the only rational explanation would be that someone created that that single point because in our human experience, uh, in our human nature. We don't know nothing that just comes into existence without anything being there, right? Yeah, I, 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 I just can't, can't see that. I've just not had any reason to believe that there is anything that has caused everything to come into existence. But yeah, do you and, do you have a do you have a I, I'm quite a rational person, but I wouldn't. I would. I wouldn't say I've, I've. I've seen anything in the last 29 years that I've been around to to, to give me a, a rational reason to um, to believe in. But do you have a do you have a a better an explanation as to the you know the creation of the singularity point? Yeah, but I, th- I think. I, I don't think everything needs an explanation. I think things happen without and they a purpose. Just happen. Yeah, they're, they're not not. You have science and physics and yeah and biology and things happen because of because there's there's sort of yeah there's there's like a science behind the way they happen. And, but, but I I mean that's but, that's but exactly it's right. Not, it's it's not because someone's pressed a button or like, that's a really simple way of saying it. But it's not because someone's made it happen. It's just it's happened <laughs> okay but what about the um, what about the laws that govern nature what about um, the fact that you know physics has its limitations and you know mathematics uh, we're able to kind of you know there's laws behind it right there's boundaries yeah. if there's limits and boundaries even in nature there's there's patterns to life um, you know there must be an authority, some type of go- uh, govern- governance over yeah, I, over such laws. I, yeah, I don't know if I if I ever ever really thought that. I think yeah. Do Do you agree that there are laws in place that you know that there, keep there, us limited? I, I, I probably wouldn't call them laws. I'd probably say there's there's sort of reasons for for certain things that happen in in physics or in in life, but I. But you just said that you you don't think there's reason to life. No, no, I, I think there's reasons why why you're going through that green light and it's or, or you're not going to go through it when it's amber. But but I wouldn't say that was that was a higher existence that made that change from green to amber. No, that's free will. I'd, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I'd I'd say that was because the 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 um, light is designed to turn red at that particular time. Um, and that might be yeah, because that, someone's programmed it to, right? Might, yeah, that might be because of free will. But yeah, I don't think that I don't. I don't but think. but here's the difference: that light, yeah, is programmed to do that, right? So it's going yeah. to do that regardless. And me, I have the free will whether to go yeah, through it or not. Yeah, you chose to stop when right. it, when it was green or or amber. Right. So I made that I made that choice. Yeah. But the light is governed by, uh, you know, a law that's programmed it in a, in a, in, a, in a in a matter of speaking. Yeah. It follows. It follows a rule that's been programmed, right? Yeah. I mean, if it's working in accordance, then it will. It will just continuously keep changing. 
So, okay. Um, do you know much about embryology? Embryology? Yeah. Um, a li- little bit, but I wouldn't say I was an expert on something. Okay, would you, would you say, um, rationally think 